Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back, guys. Ah, who's ready to get some writing done? Ah, that was a great planning session, guys. Very, very productive. And made me think a lot about things that I definitely need to take a closer look at. Oh, we've got Ellie with all caps. I have a fancy new tablet converts that converts my handwriting to text automatically. I don't even need an app. The pen does it for me. Oh, sweet. Christmas tree, Mrs. Claus wrap gift. I love it. Uh, Madison Ellie. Ooh, what is it? How is it? And Mary, hello again. And well, Ellie, that is awesome. I agree. And it is a Samsung Tab S8 plus 128 gigabyte storage with S Pen. Nice. Madison, I love writing with my pen on my Surface Pro. I hear those Samsungs rock. Ah, well, you'll have to tell us how it goes. <laughs> Sounds amazing so far. Um, Ellie, I'm loving it. I can finally play Sims on a huge screen. Interesting. Instead of my tiny phone. Ah, okay. Mass and grass, that sounds wonderful. Mary, it's been, sorry, I've been thinking seriously about an iPad come tax time, but I may look into Samsung too. I had one several years ago and it was good until my then eight year old son worked it to death. Oh no! Ah! <laughs> Loved it a little too much. Uh, Ellie, I was painting but my tablet showed up unexpectedly getting uh <laughs> all awesome okay that baby's mine <laughs> no touchy <laughs> nice from down home geek uh enjoy your new tablet ollie definitely love sweater oh thank you something cozy for this wintry day we we have snow outside <laughs> Snow person. Ah, uh, Diane had Tracy. Thank you for hosting. You are so welcome. Uh, Mary, yes, I'm so glad my son is older now and wouldn't dream of killing any technology. Yes. Uh, Diane, hey, Hardies. Uh, Mary, hi, hi, hi. Sounds very cool, Ellie. Yes, definitely. Heather, hi. Ready to get some editing finished. Um, Ellie, um, thanks for this. Hello again. Ready to do some sprints. Awesome. Good to hear. Stephanie, I'm going to generate ideas for the next book in my series. Nice. Ellie, I have a little issue with words sticking together. I'm not sure what that means, but I think I know what that means. Um, Julie working on drafting a novella today. Awesome. Uh, Phyllis, I'm going to continue planning and do some self-care. I am also planning to do some free writing as well. Love that. Uh, working on edits from Madison. Down Home Geek, just working on 2023 and Q1 plans. I very much want to finish it today. But don't push. Give yourself the time to make sure it all works. And Rita, hello. Okay, guys, we're going to dive right on in. Um, looks like we have a good showing so far. Um, for anyone that is new, we do things differently around here. We play with times. Um, I'll ask that in a minute as to which series you guys want to do. Also, um, we also do um, what I call my two minute micro sprint plan in which we define what we're going to do each and every sprint so that we are maximizing our output and ensuring what gets that hits the page belongs there and moves our stories forward. Uh, so what you're looking to do is use the phrase in the first sprint I will or in the next sprint I will, depending if you've written yet today, in uh, what you need to reveal about character plot or setting, what you're trying to get your protagonist to do on the page, the obstacles and opportunities you're going to toss at them to create conflict, uh, reveal relationships, and just just to work, uh, give you more opportunities to get um, to really work that character on the page. Um, the action steps you're going to take to get through that scene or chapter you're working on. So nice beginning, middle, end. Just kind of give yourself a quick guide. The uh, resources you're going to need. So your any computer systems, iPads, laptops, uh, notebooks, anywhere that you may have put something that you may want to refer to. Um, your favorite uh, beverage or a tall glass of water. Um, any resource books in terms of craft books that you might want to have at hand. Just bring it all out, put it around you, and that way you're centered and ready to work. And finally, the outcome you're looking for. Uh, Dan, I love my iPad so much I ended up getting a mini. I am thinking about the Pro after Sarah unboxed hers. 
I don't know if I want to lug along a lot bigger one after downsizing. Hers looks fabulous, but it looks heavy. <laughs> it does, right? It looks it looks quite big. I can't remember. The mini is seven inches. I can't remember how big the mini is. Ellie, I downgraded my phone size. I got the Galaxy Flip 4. It folds closed. Oh, interesting. Rachel, in the Sprint, my main group is planning to steal the power source that they don't know they are walking into, a but don't know that they're walking into a trap. Tuna fish words. Oh, love that. Okay, guys, in the first sprint, I will, or in the next sprint, I will. Two minute timer and go. Rita to Rachel, your story sounds intriguing. Definitely agree. Heather, in the first sprint, I figure out where I left off. I'm with you on that. I have not touched my writing in a couple days, so yes, definitely. Uh, Rachel to Rita, thank you. I've written or rewritten this story so many times that I'm confident in my character's plot and setting. Love that. Mary, in the first sprint, I will open my due document I have set up for my work in progress and start converting my two big novel into manageable short stories. Ooh, good, good plan. Uh, Diane, the mini screen is 8.3, the pro is 12.9, but looks huge. Yeah, it does. I have the, um, what do you call it, Generation 9? I think it is a 11.2 or something, or 11.3, something like, I can't remember the actual number, but it's about as big as I think I want to go. Anything bigger, and I'm like, yeah, this is not going to be as much fun. The 8.3, though, that sounds very um, enticing, <laughs> very portable. Uh, goals with Michelle, let's see, in the first sprint, I will be adding slides for mindset to my course. Interesting. Mary, still working on my office. Great progress today. Beautiful. Okay, right, guys, I didn't actually talk about the times we're going to do. Um, we're going to do, um, we have two options. Uh, a 20, two 25s and a 20, or a 20, a 30, and a 45. Option A or option B? 20s and 25s or uh, the step method 20, 30, 45? Which one do you want? Option A or option B? Let us know and uh, while everybody uh, throws up as uh, their, uh, their plan. I am getting back to the snowflake method because I found it to be very, very helpful. And then I, for book two and then for book 
three. I only did half of it and then found myself a little lost in the woods. <laughs> oh, I got a B and an A, okay. Another B. Oh, we're getting good Bs here. Similar tablet, I tend not to use it. I thought I'd use it for YouTube sprints instead of my laptop if I am not using the laptop, but I need help setting it up so it's it's so old. Ah, I see. Okay, so far it looks like B is winning out. Any other any other votes? What would you guys like to do today? Oh, splitting it. Ah, okay. I need someone to split that vote. Let's see. What do we got? <laughs> oh, that was external. <laughs> ah, I don't remember what size my first iPad is. Ah, it's probably smaller. They've been getting bigger. Unruly in my opinion. <laughs> a, okay, so for A is winning. Okay, we'll go for another 30 seconds. Final count. And then we'll dive into getting our words on the page. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ayrton, yes, photo average, I think. I like mine because it kind of reminds me of the, um, like a nice planner size, like a nice classic happy planner size kind of thing. So I, I find it's a comfortable size, but it's still not truly all that portable. I don't know. But then I'm finding a B6 to not be as portable as I'd like it. Well, it looks like we're going with A, guys. So we're going to do a 20 followed by two 25s and another 20. We need to take time to make supper some sprints. Okay, awesome. Okay, guys, we're going to dive on in. Deep breath. Let's pour ourselves on the page. The 20 we kind of use as a bit of a warm up. Um, just to kind of get our writing mind on. That way we can enjoy the rest of the sprints and really make some awesome progress. Okay, guys. First 20 minutes, good luck, good ready. I'll see you on the other side.
So how did you guys do? Um, let's see, I saw quite the conversation going on here. Uh, where did it begin? Phyllis, Rita, I just purchased a writer's notebook. You inspired me from our planning session. Do so. I ah, love that. Uh, let's see, Diane, I love my mini size iPad. It's a Diane Lock size. Love that. <clears throat> Stephanie and Phyllis, which one? Uh, Diane, how fabulous. Enjoy. Uh, Rita, I love mine. I have so much details in my plot, backstory, characters. Nice. I may have found a portable option. I will be sharing that soon. Ellie, my main character, accidentally opened a portal to hell and unleashed demons last school year. Now everyone hates her. I love it. <laughs> Perfect. Ah, let's see. Rita. Oh, okay. Um, Rita to Phyllis, are you familiar with the Discord and Facebook group on the Wings for Writers with S.A. Crow? She's offering a workshop in January about writer's notebook setup. Very important, formative. Oh, sweet. Well, I will have to note that down. Dan, okay, I am in Sarah's Discord, but don't know how to connect with any live parties. I would love to check out on the Wings for Writers. Does she have a YouTube channel? I do believe she does. Uh, Dan, Hildy McQueen's YouTube is filled with amazing writer goodies. Oh, no, no. Um, let's see. Jasmine Gail Norm has a YouTube channel you should peek at. Oh, another good one. Okay. Or Yasmin. Sorry. I said there. I don't know why I said Jasmine. Um, okay. Check that out, too. Uh, at least sounds good. Um, thanks. Inspired by Wednesday on Netflix. Ah, Jody sliding in late. No problem. It's okay. Phyllis to Stephanie and Rita. I decided to go with Ready Set Memoir by Lindsay Grant, former director for NaNoWriMo. It is the first one I have seen that is focused on memoir. Excited. Oh, that's very cool. Excellent resource there. Diane. Oh, Wednesday Adams. I see. Go Ellie. Yes. Um, loving the series, definitely. Ellie, it was incredible. Nice. Diane, have fun, uh, Phyllis. Happy writing. Thanks, Diane. Right back. And welcome, Phyllis. I love how polite this group is. Phyllis, I love this group. So encouraging. <laughs> Diane Hardy's, are you into Notion Trello? I did Trello, kind of, sort of, but didn't feel it was for me. I don't know. Sarah's HP90 method hits the bells and whistles. Adding Notion to Trello seems like seems like one more thing and i feel pressure to go 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 i can't be the only one and my heart is i love i love grabbing in a quick second job. yes um seems like uh let's see phyllis great sprint i updated my writing canvas i ordered a write a writing notebook nice excited about my plans for 2023 ali be right back kiddo bedtime uh to do and earlier this year, I thought I would finally use Astrology, so I ordered the B6. 
Anyway, I felt like it was too much to draw a calendar, a daily page, and all the stuff to it. I used stickers, but did not want to waste energy designing what I could purchase already put together. Yeah, I hear you on that. That's exactly where I am at. Uh, for this, also 160 words. Nicely done. Down home, let's see. Uh, Diane, no, you are not the only one. I know I do best with paper planners, but I am feeling the pull of the digital planning. My fear of the, I'm going to use the digital planning for something that's more um, long term based, and I think that'll work. I can't use it as a daily, it doesn't quite work for me. It's too, it's not. It's like Sarah always says, she needs it in her face. She, she, out of, out of, out of, out of sight, out of mind. Totally, completely. Um, so I need to have it where I can see it and work with it. Um, but longer term current planning, I think it'll actually be really good. Heather, I got distracted, didn't get much accomplished. That's okay, it happens. Diane, down home, I will add Sarah's digital planner for Q1. Nice. Uh, down home, I only the only planner I've consistently used is Hobonichi Cousin, and then a notebook to catch all my squirrels. I love that term. <laughs> uh, thank you, down home, term Diane. Uh, Rita, Rita Diane, yes, she has a YouTube and live sprints Friday and Saturday mornings. Come out the check out the group on YouTube and her own channel too. Sweet. Tammy, 249 words, can't get over the desire to edit while drafting. I'm sure I am not alone there. Mm -hmm. uh, Diane, yes, uh, yay for the notebook catch-all. I will call them my squirrel chipmunk. <laughs> love it, love it, love it, yes. Uh, Inca, and hey everyone, uh, the three-day migrant is finally taking a hike, but I'm still going slow. Oh no, virtual hugs, hun. Oh, I hope you're feeling better. Three day migraine, wow. Huh. I'm glad it's starting to leave though. Just take it easy, don't re trigger it. Go slow. Rita, I enjoy Yasmin Gilman's Gail Norm's books too. Oh, interesting. Uh, thank you, Rita. Down home, uh, I bought Sarah's undated digital planner. It looks so cool. It was less than an hour before I was back in paper. Oh no! Yeah, I know. I hear you. <laughs> Mary grabbed a quick snack and another cup of iced coffee mixed with almond milk, trying to cut back on caffeine, but so far I'm failing. Laugh out loud. Opened my work doc and tried a couple of tile changes. Nice. Mary, I decided to keep it the same. Um, Diane, oh, uh, down home, hum, hum. I need it all up in my work. Yeah. Inca Diane, I use Notion for planning the quarter and as a good overview, but do all my daily work in the planner. Yeah, makes sense. Uh, Diane, therefore, I have to touch it. I have to see it. Oh, perfectly said. There you go. Perfectly said. Um, let's see. Rita, I prefer paper too. I even write my first draft and all my notes on paper. Perfect. Uh, let's see. Mildred, brother is here. See you later. Hope you have a good day, hun. Phyllis, uh, I agree. I use the paper planner for daily, weekly planning, but my digital Kanban for long-term and project planning. And I think that's where the balance has to be. Um, although some people, they're on their phone so much. That's the problem. I could not get um, Notion to work on my phone. I hated it. Sorry, guys. Oh. I want that one to have. <laughs> Heather, I know this is the last sprint of the year, but I think I'm going to admit I'm just not feeling it today. Merry Christmas to everyone who celebrates. Happy New Year. See you next year. Heather, go relax. You do what you need to do, hon. You know that, right? We love you and we'll see you for um hopefully on Friday for the 23rd for our uh for our planning session. You take care, hon. Uh Diane, digital Kanban, where am I? Uh where may I check it out? Oh, yes. Yes. What are you using for the digital Kanban? Um, I know Notion has a feature for that. Oh. Down home, my brain just spazzes out with digital. I tried again yesterday and I ended up watching the RWF and the Hobbit. Oh, no. Ah, oh, Diana, take care, Heather. Thank you. Happy New Year. Yes. Uh, take care, Heather. What else you got? 
Down Home, Geek to Heather, Merry Christmas to you and yours, definitely, Phyllis as well, Happy Holidays to you as well, and Diane, I think I have the same wiring thing with my brain down home, yes. Okay guys, let's dive into our second two minute micro sprint plan, this one's for a 25. In the next sprint I will, what you need to reveal about character plot or setting, what you're trying to get your protagonist to do on the page. The uh, obstacles and opportunities you're going to toss at them, the action steps you're going to take to get there, the resources you're going to need at hand, and the outcome you're looking for. In the next sprint, I will. And go. Oops. <laughs> oh, um. <coughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, mm. Okay, what did I see here? I see Inca with, um, yeah, Notion has Kanban, table, and calendar functionality, all from the same data set. Phyllis is using Tega for my digital Kanban, similar to Notion. Um, I guess this, I don't know if this is a fair question or not. Easier to use or harder to use than Notion? Uh, Diane, yeah, no, I think, I don't think my brain connects or focuses the same with digital planning. Again, I have to see it, I have to touch it. I have to add stickers and washi, real stickers and washi, yes, definitely. Down home to Diane and happiness. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, Diane, thank you, Phyllis. I will peek at it. Rachel, in the sprint, my main character may have to come to terms that a trusted source may have to betrayed her. Oh no. Phyllis, in the next sprint, I will complete up complete updating my paper planner. I will then do some self-care and prep for, for tomorrow. If I have time, I'll do some additional free writing. Goal 150 words. Beautiful. Uh, down home, I need an excuse for my fountain pen habit. <laughs> paper helps with that too. Yes, it does. Uh, Mary, um, in the next sprint, I will go through each scene and figure out what stays and what goes. This will pretty much be my plan going forward. Perfect. Uh, Diane, I will check As Asana out too. I've heard that's a good one as well. Diane, thank you, Inca, and uh, Elizabeth, my nap felt good. I'm glad you feel better. Okay, guys, 25 minutes. Good luck, good writing, and I'll see you on the other side of 25.
How did you guys do? Let's see, let's see. So quite a bit of chat going on. Oh, I see right here. Okay. Um, Phyllis, um, referring to Tega, um, is much easier to set up and use. Pretty simple layout, which sounds good actually for a Kanban board. <laughs> Pardon me. Inca, in the next sprint, I'll do some beta reading. Nice. Smile, laugh, giggle with Denise. Hi all, how are you doing? Uh, thank you for joining us. Elizabeth, in the sprint, I will start doing Kanban board. Perfect. Uh, Stephanie, I don't know where my Kanban is left below. I think it's still at my old house, my dear. Oh dear. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, Mary, I am so with you guys on paper planning. I can't do digital for day to day. I have to have paper. I like digital for appointments, so Google Calendar makes sure I don't forget anything unless I forget to put it in. So true. Um, Diane, what's Steph? <laughs> yes, Diane. Um, yes, Mary, I agree. I pop appointments in my Google Calendar. It's quick. I do add the appointments, reminders, and tasks to my paper calendar. Yes have to have it in both places for sure. Diane, uh, hi I'm Diane, a paper pen stationery sticker of Moshi Attic. <laughs> ah, stationery is my kryptonite. I love it and you're good, very good company, hun. Uh, Phyllis, yes Mary, I use Google Calendar as well for my personal appointments and Outlook for work meetings appointments. Perfect. I love this planning discussion. It's nice to meet other fellow planners. Writers are planners. It's so true. Ah, Dan, writers are everything. Oh, love that. Uh, Dan, me too, Phyllis. Uh, Dan, has anyone used Dabble? I used it a couple times. I like it so far, but here is another thingamajig. I don't want to be all over. I want one thing for everything. I may have to learn, really learn the sure where that continues. Rachel Diane, I share frustration. Uh, Rosalind um, to Diane, I use Dabble for pretty much everything. I love the plot grid for outlining and the fact that I can use it across all devices with different OS OS's is a huge plus. Now that does sound very, very intriguing. Uh, Rosalind, I've been using it since launch. I, I've always found their support people to be really helpful too. Interesting. Diane, updated version of Scrivener. Plotter is calling me, but it may be just another way to fall into the distraction hole. I have started to use Google Docs, but it seems to, uh, seems to no frills. Maybe I need that. Hmm. Uh, smile, uh, laugh, giggle. Hi, hi, Dan. I love your name though. This, the, the smile, laugh, giggle, uh, with, uh, with Denise. I love that. love that care of Denise. Um, Diane, thank you, Rachel. I want my writing act together for 2023. If not, at least Q1. You've got this. You've got this. Be kind. Uh, Diane, it is the across platforms I love about Dabble 2. However, I think my brain wants to find the it for everything. The Amazon Target Walmart writing fix. <laughs> I love that. That's perfect. Uh, Rachel to Diane, same. Uh, some of my goals for Q1 is to finish the first book of my series called Project Tempest. Diane, let's do this Rach, a break, a breath at a time. I am thinking of making a list of nine tasks a week. 
I can stick to without overwhelming myself. I took a tumble down some stairs in April and have been through some evolutionary changes, challenges. My brain has been saying, no, nope, no, nope, no, not that. I have post-concussion syndrome from the fall down the stairs. It has been eight months since the tumble. It was due to negligence of my former landlord. It feels good to share this outside of my family and my medical team. I have a TBI since the fall. Wow. I hope you're on the mend. It sounds like you've got everything the way it needs to be to be on the mend. But wow. Now there's another uh, writer I know from around here. The same thing. She had a... She had a... Um, she got hit in the head with... I think it was a ball. I can't remember exactly the circumstances. And then just as she went back to work, it basically happened again. And basically all the concussion issues right back. Like she'd not taken any time off to heal. Such bad luck, right? Uh, feels good. Sprint finished uh, updating my calendar for this week. About to step away for a break. I'll be back in a bit. Well, I hope you have a great break, Rachel. Not Rachel. Uh, fellas. <laughs> Uh, Rachel, let's see, to Diane, that must, that must suck. Um, I'm glad you're feeling better and can, we can both make 2023 our year. I love that. Diane, let's make every moment ours, Rich. We are everything, so we don't need a new year to do it. Let's reset, though. Clean slate, fresh snow. Love that. I love the hashtag. Uh, absolutely D. I love it. Uh, down home geek, I love that. I am with you. Clean slate, fresh snow. Perfect, guys. Perfect. Elizabeth, I'm looking through my 2023 plan and coming up with micro tasks based on those tasks. Oof, beautiful. Um, Diane, I was getting my act for 2023 together. Sweet. Elizabeth, 2023 is going to be an amazing year. Rachel Elizabeth, I hope so. Definitely. We're going to make it amazing, right? That's the goal. Um, Diane, yes, Rach, down. Uh, Rachel, thank you for making me feel at home. Oh, uh, down home, I will be uh, 49 in a little less than two months. I am hoping the seven times seven thing is spot on. 2023 will be our year. Nice. Hey, Tyler, join middle of that sprint experimenting with mid journey AI. Interesting. Um, Diane, birthday celebration countdown, definitely. Um, down home Diane with the revolving hearts. Uh, Rachel to down home, happy early birthday. And seven is the number of perfection. So double seven equals double perfection. Ah, Mary, I worked on the first scene of my new short story. I already have an idea how I'm going to reshape the story into a short form. Beautiful. Inca, that's so awesome. Or awful, sorry, so awful, Diane. Um, I hope next year is a great one for you. Uh, I am determined to take the challenges to grow. <sighs> Love that spirit. Uh, let's see. Elizabeth, 2022 has been a crazy year, and I feel that 2023 is going to be a bug year year uh, hugs uh diane to rachel hugs and rachel to diane um hugs to you both oh perfect okay guys let's dive into our next oh, i shouldn't put the symbols over there that makes more sense all right guys we're gonna dive into our third two minute micro sprint plan this was for a 25 minute sprint um in the next sprint i will what you plan what but you need to reveal what character player setting what you're trying to get your protagonist to do on the page big year that makes more sense um obstacles and opportunities the action steps you're going to take to get there the resources you're looking going to need at hand and the outcome that you're hoping to get on that page by the end of 25 minutes two minute timer in the next sprint i will and go
Okay, let's see. Mm, what do we do here? Ah, uh, Diane, thank you, Inca. It's a weird. It is weird because I feel different. I have definitely noticed the change in who I was. I'm a different Diane. I don't know if I like me this way. Oh, interesting. Uh, let's see. And yes, big gear, much better than bug gear. Let's face it, some you could call 2020 um, and 2021 the bug gear. <laughs> ah, let's see, um, let's see, big gear. Uh, I thought that you and I are next to each other for the keyboard. <laughs> uh, let's see, Dan, let's go. In the next sprint, I will continue coming up with micro tasks for my big goals for Q1. Loving that, Elizabeth. Uh, Rachel Ann, maybe not, but that's where self-love comes in, because as humans, we are constantly changing and evolving, even if we may not be happy about it. Yes, yes. Mary, in the next sprint, I will continue working on this scene and keep going from there. Dad, my husband has a new wife. Ah, yeah, that would be... That means he has to also settle into this different life. Different, right? Rachel, in the next sprint, I plan to revise some of the goals uh, for the year and create my vision board. I can't wait to get on my revision board. Uh, revision board? Vision board. <laughs> I want to revise my vision board. Uh, Inca, in the next sprint, I will keep on with the beta reading. Diane, I am my own evil twin, Samantha versus Serena Bewitched. <sighs> Diane, okay, I have always had resistance to vision boards. They're actually kind of cool, kind of fun. Um, I resisted at first um, as well, but uh, if you put them in the right place, they actually serve you pretty good. Uh, let's see, Rita. In the next sprint, I will continue fixing the next chapter on Wattpad. Nice. Rachel, um, you may just be my soulmate, the Diane. I love it. Self-love. I am learning that slowly. Oh, yeah. yeah. Elizabeth, we didn't have 2020 vision in 2020, but instead we had a bug here. <laughs> Diane, I am digging it, Rich. I finally found my tribe. I love this. Elizabeth, 2020 was a big year and a bug year in a way that none of us could have predicted. So true. Uh, okay, guys. 25 minutes. Let's dive in and pour ourselves onto the page. Ah, I'm getting progress. I'm actually finally moving through this um, step six of the Snowflake method and realizing no wonder I was having troubles. I had things out of order and that's why I was not working. So progress is being made. So on that note, let's dive in guys. 25 minutes. Good luck. Good writing. And I'll see you on this side.
How did you do? How'd you make out? Let's see. Where are we here? Rachel, Diane, I feel the same way. Uh, Diane, Spirit keeps telling me I need to start from the beginning as a new writer since I am not the same brain wise and have to learn again. I am coming from anger, grief, and a different skillet. Interesting word. Uh, I smile, laugh, giggle. I was reading how so many of you rely on paper versus digital. I used to obsess with that format, but then I kept losing everything. So now I really have to have it all in my phone. And how have you done that? Because I find the phone too small. My Diane, I will toss ice cubes in lieu of smashing dishes in glasses. <laughs> Uh, Diane Hardy's tribe activate love it um, Diane skill set not skillet although perhaps skillet works too since I am cooking inside differently <sighs> love it uh, I smile laugh giggle if not I will surely forget about it sad because I miss the stickers and all but I know me and I will end up forgetting all of it hmm interesting <laughs> skillet for the win there's to think of entangled <laughs> Or tangled, I should say. Um, the, the Disney movie. Um, I smile, laugh, giggle, laugh out loud. Infinity. Ties Infinity. I love it. Uh, Rachel, it's good that you're self aware. I remember seeing pictures of pretty planner, paper planners and wanted to try it out. Long story short, there was washi tape everywhere. <laughs> that I see use Evernote, but hmm, something changed. Ah. Uh, uh, I smile, uh, so I'm in search of some serious inspiration to get back into my amazing writing run last month. I sort of fell off the wagon after that, and sadly, I'm questioning everything. Just awful. Oh, no. You're, <clears throat> you paused long enough to skip to let self-doubt climb in. Um, let's see, Phyllis, the next sprint, I will start making dinner and eat it. It, um... If there, if there is time, I will start looking at the requirements for a writing retreat that I am considering for Q1. Nice. Uh, Diane to Denise, uh, two hearts. Uh, I smile doing a computer virtual desktop cleanup with the hope that I will carry my clear my head and I can get back on track. Not having inspiration is very upsetting. Yes, I hear you. Yeah, that sounds great, Phyllis. Jody, going to eat dinner with the family. We'll be back on late with the owls. Yes, Lisa's on tonight after us at 7 p.m. 10 p.m. Eastern? What is it? <laughs> I know it's a bit. We get a bit of a break. I know that. Uh, let's see. Yes, 10 p.m. Eastern. So Lisa will wrap up the night. Uh, let's see. Um... And Phyllis, do you participate in Heart Breathing's virtual writing retreats? Oops. Um, I agree, agree, Denise from Diane. Any Hardys participate in the Heart Breathing's virtual writing retreats? Love them, love them, love them. Definitely. Diane, enjoy Jody. Stephanie, Diane, I never have, but I want to. When is the next one? Um, we will do one in January. And I want to say. We're sticking in the same structure, so it should be the third weekend, which I think would, <clears throat> good question, um, hmm, and is that going to be, I think it's written down on the, there's a page that has all of our dates written down on it. Um, in the heart breathing community group um, check that out is <coughs> pardon me it's the third weekend but the question is is it going to be because the first is on a Sunday is it going to be like it'll look like it the third or the fourth because that's only the partial uh, let's see um, uh, da -da -da. Uh, I smile the virtual retreats sound like inspiration I could currently use and I would love to be a part definitely and we also have live streaming every single day of the week so and of course there's going to be a little bit of a break because of Christmas so I don't know how solid the weekly plan is how many people are going to actually go all the way to, throughout the week 
but um, normally we, we do at least, I think, two live sessions a day. So keep that in mind. Uh, down home, um, I don't know if anyone knows World of Warcraft, but Liquid just got the first mythic kill of Rude, Rude Keeper Durna. All that's left is the final boss of the raids. Oh, cool. Well, it's a great sprint. I reviewed the requirements and started my application for retreat. Still need to prepare dinner. We'll do that next sprint. Perfect. Diane, I downloaded Notion on my phone to dig deeper and download Asana. I, know, I like how Asana's interface is. I will compare further afterwards. Thank you, Hardies, for being so encouraging and understanding. Beautiful. Diane, I will. it will be in January down home. Also, we can plan a writing retreat Q1 and accountability day weekend. Ooh, love that. Mary got through scene one and headed into scene two. Tyler got 362. My character just discovered a secret room with silver tipped arrows and bows. Ooh, Diane jumped in that niece, definitely. Just completed my submission with Phyllis. Perfect. Down, to, down home to Diane. Oops. Uh, where did I just go? I love that. It has taken me years to get up the courage to join the sprints. I am so glad I did. It helps so much to be around other writers. So true, so true. Diane, good luck, Phyllis. Rita, making supper. Phyllis, thanks, Diane, and a welcome back. And Phyllis Tyler, great job. Your character's art sounds interesting. It does. Diane, no pressure down home. You can email me a few tasks or whatever if you want. Same for you, Denise. Hardy said um, the same to you. Beautiful. Down home to Phyllis. Nice job. I smiled to Diane. Are you thinking of creating your own virtual retreat? I would be thrilled to take part. Just let me know. Love that. Phyllis, thanks down home. Okay, guys, we are going to dive into our final two minute micro sprint plan. This one's going to be for 20. What you need to reveal about character plotter setting, what you're trying to get your protagonists to do on the page, the obstacles and opportunities you're going to toss at them, the action steps that you are going to take to get that scene on the page, the resources you're going to need at hand, and the outcome you're looking for. In the next sprint, I will. And go. Okay, what did you guys come up with? Uh, Phyllis to Tyler, you're welcome. Uh, down home to Phyllis, thank you. And Diane, email away from downtown, down, down home. Mm. Same for you, Denise. We can start tonight, three tasks minimum, so we aren't overwhelmed as a foundation. Uh, we can begin with one. Oh, are we gonna be within? I love that. Down home, Diane, sounds like a plan. Oh, sounds amazing. 
And I think I have a structure for the book. Uh, I have to make what's in front of me not be gobbledygook. <laughs> and um, get this ending sort of fleshed out. And um, I think I finally have a plan. And I think I know why I was struggling. Because I had, had them... Um, had like first half of the book them basically planning on how to get back inside and it was like no I can't do that <laughs> it's not gonna work uh, let's see talk about delaying the inevitable right um, Mary in the next print I will keep going and get as far as I can got an appointment with one of my former students at 8 p.m. so we'll have to stop then but maybe after that's over I can get back into it sweet this down home I started attending the revised writer sprints retreats and planning sessions earlier this year it has been great to have a community of writers to be a part of oh, that sounds awesome thank you uh, and i'm glad i have a small part in that um diane and away we go down home love it oh okay guys let's pour the remainders of ourselves onto the page and let's make this 20 minutes count um for anyone who's joined us throughout the uh the live uh my next writing sprints will be on January 1st, 2023, because everything else lands at a Christmas or New Year's Eve time slot. And um, our next planning session will be um, December 23rd, which will be a Friday at 3 p.m. Eastern. And the following one will be on the 30th, um, also a Friday at 3 p.m. Eastern. So watch for those. Uh, let's see. Um, down home, by the way, it's Dana, way easier. I keep meaning to start a YouTube channel, hence the channel name. Ah, I see. Well, welcome, Dana. Uh, Phyllis, uh, the first sprint, I will finish dinner and eat. I will also look at my running countdown and plan for the next week. Thanks again for a great day of planning and sprints. Thank you, Tracy. Oh, you're so welcome. Uh, Phyllis, awesome, definitely. Okay, guys. 20 minutes. Let's make this one count. Good luck, good writing, and I'll see you on the other side.
So how did you guys do? Um, I think I finally figured out what the missing piece was. And it was a person that was right there the whole time who had her doing one thing. There was so much more that she could have been doing. And now I figured that out. It's going to work. It's going to work so good. Uh, let's see. Um, where did we leave off? Oh. Okay, Diane, I am having a blast today. Thank you, Hardys. Thank you, Tracy. You're so welcome, Diane. Uh, Phyllis, first sprint equals last. <laughs> That's okay. Down home, thanks, uh, Diane. I will jump onto this YouTube channel thing for summer 2023. Ooh, love that. Good plan. Uh, a down home, a hearty day is always a good day. That is awesome. I love that. We need a t-shirt with that. <laughs> we totally do. Ah, I will have to get Sarah to see if she can make something, a mug or something, right? I love that. Uh, let's see, Rachel, uh, agreed, definitely. Um, Diane, I had a private channel when my first book came out to uh, practice however insecurities demolish that i will definitely and finally start a podcast in q1 it will be about priority stuff sweet diane i am putting that down as a task woohoo finally i love it uh down home you've got this and it sure is down home uh let's see thank you for back from diane i am considering morasco world morasco land all things morasco or the Morasco experience, or the Diane Morasco experience. Feedback accepted. I also like home with Diane Morasco. Oh, nice, good options. Uh, my heart pipped in with simply Morasco. Oh, that's good and clean too, I like that. Uh, Diane, thoughts? My sister should always DM as, as always Morasco, maybe the one. Hmm, always DM. You got some good options. I like the Simply one. That's what I like. Uh, Diane, I am going to plan our first virtual retreat for March 2023. Nice. Diane, home, I, down home, I think the heart always wins. The muse has to take the break once in a while. <laughs> I love that. Uh, Diane's suggestions are accepted. Um, my muse must have filed for divorce. <laughs> Simply Morasco it is. Love it. 
Uh, down home diet. I understand about keeping your channel private. I had about four videos, that, but I didn't keep up with it. So I figured a fresh start was in order. Yes, smart for sure. Uh, Diane, I was practicing reading my first book and it wasn't set to private as I believe. I was getting feedback as to reading my book weekly. I freaked. I haven't been near it since 2016. Oh no. Oh, especially if you thought it was private. Oh no. Um, down home, laugh aloud. She's there, my friend. She's just a bit fickle once in a while. <laughs> yes. Diane, my husband encourages me to break out from being shy. It is insecurities from childhood. I love my privacy. However, I am an extroverted introvert. Down home, I get it. I finished writing my second book in 2016. I have yet to edit any, any of my four books. I tried to start editing them and well, enough said. Mm. Editing is a completely different skill. Get yourself the skills that you need for that. Do some, watch some videos, do some practicing. Get yourself familiar and comfortable, right? Dan, she is afraid of success. <laughs> Dan, uh, rolling on the floor laughing, yes. Uh, fear, a down home. Fear is a mind killer. Oh, so is. And uh, Diane, husbands have a way of being right. Yes, they do. Uh, Diane, my first book hit number one and I was a number one hot new release. I was on Amazon bestselling author. An Amazon bestselling author in Amazon Australia gave me international bestselling author status and I freaked. I still am wondering who I am. Oh, who am I? Oh no. <laughs> that is awesome though. Congrats. That is fantastic. Believe in yourself. You've got this. You've so got this. Uh, down home, at least mine does. Most of the time it is helpful. Sometimes it is bloody annoying. <laughs> and an imposter. Yep, yep, yep. I am. Yeah. Fear is my weed killer and I am obviously the weed. Oh, be brave. Be brave. Take those first steps. Uh, let's see. Down, down home. Uh, Diane, no, you got it. Even Stephen King feels that way. You're good. That just means you are doing what you should be. Fear indicates you're on the right track. So true. Uh, or you are you're about to jump out of an airplane. Uh, that's uh, what the parachute is for. Yes. Fear loves me. Uh, yes. Yes. <laughs> I, I definitely agree. Uh, Elizabeth, I looked at a couple poems and edited a bit of those. And now I am working on a short bio myself. Yes. Tyler, a little over 100 words and researched bow, bow types. Cool. Uh, Diane, my parachute, parachute is faulty. <laughs> Love the metaphors. Uh, Elizabeth, I took a break from Kanban planning. Uh, Mary, well, that one went fast. I made a good amount of progress. Thanks for the sprints. They really helped. I'm glad that you had a good time and I'm glad that they helped. And I love Hardy's t-shirt. Yes, I know. Certainly. Uh, Phyllis, great sprint. I am still working on my dinner, but I had a great day overall. Over 200 words. Updated Kanban and clean submission. Thanks for amazing, for amazing day of planning and sprints. I am so glad. Let's see, Tiffany. I generated several ideas for my next book. Happy holidays, everyone, from Phyllis. Hugs, Dana, from Diane. Rachel, happy holidays. Inca, thanks for hosting, Tracy. Hope you all have a wonderful holiday season. Uh, definitely you too, Inca. Uh, Rita, happy holidays to all. Down home. <laughs> okay. Uh, down home. Um, Diane, Merry Christmas, happy holidays. And thank you, Tracy. Thank you, Hardys. You are so welcome, Diane. My husband is smart. He is the one who got me, me to say I do. Oh, I love it. Uh, Mary, happy holidays, everyone. Well, thank you guys for joining me. Go and kick back and relax. If you still have a little energy, Lisa's on at 10 p.m. Eastern tonight. I'll see you guys throughout the week. Um, Remember to make sure your plans include some rest and relaxation so you can really enjoy the holidays and completely take advantage of having time with family and friends and just relaxing and enjoying all the all the good bits of all the good and fun parts of the season. Uh, thank you for subscribing, JC. Uh, let's see. Um, 
Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, everyone, from Elizabeth. And take care, Dana. I think that's one or down home, not sure which one. Uh, see, uh, down home to Elizabeth. Congrats. And uh, congrats, Elizabeth. Did I miss one? Um, and uh, some more congrats for Elizabeth. And thank you, and thank you, and thank you, thank you. <laughs> see you at the next planning session. I will see you guys on the 23rd for our planning session. Okay, guys, I'm out of here. Have an amazing day. Kick back, relax, go play with your planners. Get that plan in there. Do your master, uh, your weekly your master plan for the week and uh, get yourself organized and have everything where it needs to be so you can enjoy the next two weeks coming at us uh, knowing everything's in its place. I'll see you guys soon. Bye guys. Happy holidays if you can't make it to the Friday one, but I hope you catch a replay. Okay guys, bye. See you soon.